let us build the circuit. Listen, let us build the circuit that we had for super positive theorem, right? So start from 12 volt positive and then uh, this register, right? And after that, listen, in the final exam, this experiment you have to show. Okay, then all experiment will be there, but I, I guess this and, and other all superposition. Mostly this, between these two, you have to show. That each and every one. Uh, so yes, yes, yes. yes. we will give uh, five arrangement. Yeah, almost. Okay, listen. And after that, two register will but start, you right? That all come from the project. Uh, okay, I, I, I cannot hear you. I will listen. <laughs> listen. Uh, I'll, I'll speak about it. Another is R five. Project has some mark, but uh, not all questions from the project. It's not. Uh, it was not told. It was told in other groups, in other sections, I mean, maybe FEDS, right? In FEDS, not this course. This course has some marks. Yes, you have to build this as is. Yeah, right. Yeah. After that, after that, listen, after that, this, this register, uh, this register uh, ends at, 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 okay? Five volt, and the other register ends at, Oh no, this in the mid this in the middle. This will be end at ground, right? Yes, sir. And the third register will end at five volt positive. Five volt right. And and five volt uh, ground and twelve volt ground it will be shorted, right? So this three, okay. This is the yes. Do you understand this this circuit? Hmm? Now our first job is just to disconnect load register. So this is the load register. Right? This is the load register. So disconnect load register. Now this is the two disconnected terminal, right? Yes. So for now, place a voltmeter in between this. Because and after that, okay, do you see a voltmeter <coughs> on this? Yes, yes, sir. Okay. <coughs> Why student is opening everything? Right. Look, it's a voltmeter for now, right? So now place a voltmeter between these two disconnected terminal. Where is, where is this two disconnected terminal? One is this, yes. and is this. <laughs> so placing a voltmeter, one is this, and another will be this. So I placed these two disconnected terminal from where the resistor is removed, right? So placing the voltmeter, now switch it on, where is the switch? Is that one? No, it's not yet, one. Yes, yes, sir. yes one. So do you see voltage is being shown? Point nine. This is the ETS. One volt. Huh? Record it. Even though we had, even though we had, what, what we had? We had a 5 volt source and a 12 volt source. But evidence equivalent uh, source is different, right? It's 8.98, something like that, right? 8.98. You see that? Hey, everyone, you see that? Okay. Is that okay? Yes, now, next stop. So, can you right now find easily the Thevenin's equivalence register? Oh, yes, sir. Hmm? Okay. Yes. Now, our job is just to remove these things. But still, this is the disconnected terminal, right? Yes. So, I have to switch up the power first. And then, we have to make, as both of them are voltage source, right? We have to make it short. The two disconnected terminal is here with me. So, keep it here. And for now, make both of the terminals short, right? Mm. So how to make it short? Just keep it here, put it to the ground. Ground. Remove it, put it to the, the ground. ground. Both sources are short. And now place an ohm meter here. That's the job is done, right? Yes. So make it an ohm meter and then place between these two terminals. This will show you the Thevenin's equivalent. Oh. What is that? Of course, sir. Zero. Okay. Zero. Oh, no. Power. Okay. No, 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 no. Why, why should you? Four point nine. Switch on power. No. Power will drop. Four four nine five kilo ohm. Right. Four nine five. Four nine five kilo ohm. Right. Yes, sir. Do you see that? Point four nine. Okay. Is that okay? Yes, sir. Now, now find. Divide. Thevenin the Thevenin's equivalent current. So divide it you will find the Thevenin's equivalent current, I mean the circuit current, right? Same. And you can even uh, connect an uh, emitter in the main circuit to see whether the total circuit current is this or not. So I don't think it's necessary at all. Just we have found the uh, Thevenin's equivalent potential and Thevenin's equivalent resistor. And we divided it. That's what makes the total circuit current, right? Yes, sir. Any question? No, sir. Thank you so much.